Hi all folks, this is Max from TransformerPrimeRoot.com. Today we're going to install the newest version of Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, why we're going to install this new version and also um, if you, this is just a guide on how to install it. This will install the latest version of Clockwork Mod Recovery. Um, I found that some of the newer uh, ROMs like the um, AOKP ROM, you'll need to be on the latest version of Clockwork Mod Recovery if you'll end up in a boot loop. If you end up in a boot loop, you can follow this video and uh, you can still update it while you're still in a boot loop. So to do this, just hold down volume down and the power button um, at any time. This is by my AOKP ROM by the way. Hold it down and wait until you see the letters on top here. And then here you're gonna press uh, volume down, volume down, and you get this menu. Hit uh, volume down, and select the USB thingy there, and hit the volume up. Uh oh. You know what? It's it. I didn't do it fast enough. So I'll, let me show it to you again. Hold down the volume down and the power button until it resets um, and then it shows you the three letters, three lines of letters at the top. Let go and hit the volume down and then hit the volume down again and hit the uh, volume up right away. And it'll say fast boot USB download mode there. Alright, and then we're going to connect um, our um, cable to the computer. Next you'll download Transformer Prime and Recovery New .zip and uh, you'll find a bunch of files fast boot for Linux and Mac um, and uh, basically we're gonna flash this recovery um, the new Clockwork Mod recovery so open up a command prompt uh, and for Windows you'll have to have drivers installed. If you don't know how I have a driver install um, instructions over at transformerprimeroot.com um, open up a command prompt if you don't know how google it it's not that hard um, and then browse to the directory where you copied it to um, so for me it's gonna be cd backslash transformer prime recovery new like that um, that's actually not a w it's a backslash korean font uh, makes backslash into a symbol that looks like a w which is a currency symbol that's what they use um, but it's the opposite slash of that one. So once you're here, we're gonna type fast boot, oops, fast boot minus i space zero x small x zero b zero five uh, space flash space recovery space recovery dash clockwork dash five point eight point 2.0-tf201.img and hit enter. And for Mac or Linux, you just have to change the command fastboot to dot slash dot slash um, fastboot dash Mac and also fastboot dash Linux instead. I'll have instructions over at my site. Um, and hit enter, and this will flash the the latest version of recovery. There you go. And you'll flash it, and it's done. And then we can go back to our Transformer Prime. And you can reboot by holding down the power button. And But I'll show you how to get into the new recovery. Um, so it's the same thing, volume down and the power button. And as soon as you see those uh, couple lines at the top, you're gonna hit let go of both buttons and hit volume up. You gotta do it within five seconds. So. Otherwise it'll boot. There you go, and hit volume up. And you should be on the latest 5.8.2.0. And uh, if you end up in a boot loop, um, you might be using an older version. That might be why. So I've got the new version. You're all good to go. You should be able to flash the new ROMs. Anyway, if you have a Transformer Prime, don't forget to subscribe to our email list at transformerprimeroot.com. We're up update you on stuff like this, um, ROM reviews, and more. And uh, don't share your email with anyone else. It's just for you and me. Um, and also, if you're on YouTube, don't forget to hit that like button, a uh, favorite button, um, and also subscribe to my channel if you have thanks and uh, share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google Plus. And I'm gonna get really high on Android, folks. Actually, I'm
pretty pretty high on it. Um, just get really high. All right, see y'all later.